You guys seemed to really love the last time I did a video on Clue Scrolls, so I figured I would do another one. Last time we spent 250 mil on magpie implings for hard clues, but this time I'm going to be spending 100 mil on eclectic implings for medium clues. You guys are definitely not going to want to miss this one, so let's just get right into the action. You know what we're doing, let's just get started. Now the nice thing about eclectic implings is that since these are camped pretty heavily by gold farmers and bots and tons of other people, there's tons of them available on the GE, so I was actually able to get my offer purchased fairly quickly. I did spend a little more than 100 mil, but I wanted a nice clean number of eclectic implings, and that nice clean number is 30,000. 30,000 eclectics should turn into roughly 1200 medium clue scrolls. Saying that out loud makes me realize I probably shouldn't have bought this many, but you know what? I'm committed. Let's do it. The next step is figuring out a gear setup. Now, mediums are different than hard clues because I don't actually have to go into the wilderness for these. So I'm going to try and set up another tab, kind of like how I did in the last video, and see if I can figure this one out. Came to a minor realization while building these stash units. Um, since I don't really play this account much, I actually don't have the Kevos Diary done, which would be really convenient to have the blessing. But not only that, I don't have any of the quests that allow me to teleport onto Zaya, and those are pretty important for mediums, so I'm gonna go do a couple of those really quick. So I just ended up doing the Arceus quest and the Piscarilius quest because the Piscarilius quest is the only one I really need, and the Arceus one is the fastest to get an extra eight charges in my book. So there we go, that'll help out a lot actually. All right, I got my first clue. I have some stuff here ready to go, but I found a nice setup in the gear discord that exists to show me most of the stuff that I need, so I'm probably gonna buy more as we go and buy all the different teleports just to keep my inventory the exact same every time and fill up my bank with bank fillers so I don't have to waste time taking out every single thing every single time. Not even anywhere close to done yet, but there's 200 caskets built up so far and I still have over 25,000 eclectic implings to go. 500 clues now. We're almost halfway done. Not really, but we've gone through about 12.5 thousand imps so far. Big, big milestone. Big milestone right here. When I put this casket in the bank, it is going to be the 1,000th banked medium casket. I can't believe it. That is ridiculous. I, I don't know, man. We still have probably like 100 to 150, maybe even 200 if we get really lucky to go. Okay, in all likelihood, I'm probably not going to get another clue here. 1175, considering how far I was spam- thank you, so happy I didn't get another one. Considering how far I was spam- like spamming them and going past the actual drop rate anytime I got a clue, this is really good, so I'm gonna get ready to start cracking these open. I'm not gonna show you guys every single clue because I feel like that would be boring and they're not as entertaining as hard clues, but I'll show you guys all the interesting ones. And of course, I will be doing all of the masters as well. So I need to figure out a gear setup for that too. So while I am grabbing a collection log, uh, important to note, 1,175 mediums. Theoretically, I should be getting like three rangers. So we'll see. Uh, I think I get the log from this guy right here, and I should have it be completely empty, I'm pretty sure. I've done some mediums on this account before, but I don't think I've done any since the collection log was released. So yeah, 0 out of 115. Absolutely empty. Let's see how many of these we can fill up by the end. It'd be hilarious if we get all 115. I did stream the entirety of this over on my Twitch page at twitch.tv slash losalgamer, so if you like seeing endgame PVM content and stuff like that, that's the place to go. I did also get a lot of master clues while doing this, but I'm not going to show you guys every single one of the master clues until we open them at the end because they're a 1 in 30 drop rate, so I got them pretty frequently. So unfortunately for some reason, Runelight just randomly reset all of my settings, including turning off the loot tracker. So luckily I realized this about 50 clues in, so the end when I show you guys the picture that has all of the clue scrolls in it, it's not going to say 1175, it's going to say like 1120 or something like that, but I realized it pretty early on. Man, these pages used to be worth so much more, what happened? These are like dirt cheap now. Oh, I also got the same page back to back, that's kind of cool. Bandos, cloak piss off all the iron men. Something cool. You mean wizard boots, I don't care. There we go, okay, good, fine, something cool. Second best item, I think? Manacles, we'll take it. Um, I think this is the second best item. I'm pretty sure, so that's about a mil. 
Man, that's only a mil. I literally need to get ranger boots to profit, I think. Or these master clues have to, like, put out. Let's just start cracking. Let's get some rangers, man. It's not rangers, but that's a clip. You know what? I'll actually consider this a great start to the day. We got our wizard boots already on our second clue opened for the day. Hey, another pair of boots. On 399, right before we get the clueless clue scroll, that is climbing boots G. That is our third pair of boots so far. Pretty nice. Uh, I mean, boots are the same rate as a lot of these other uniques, but they're still really cool to see. And then on number 400, not only do we pick ourselves up a cloak and a page, but we get the unique from medium-specific clues being the clueless clue scroll. So, yay. Look at all the boaters, bro. Hey, Spiked Manacles number two. You know, it's not Rangers, but it is the second best item we can get, so I will happily take another pair of Spiked Manacles on clue number 460. Doesn't really sound too appealing to me, but we got another pair of Climbing Boots G, that is, so far, so we've had two Manacles, two Climbing Boots G, and one pair of Wizard Boots. Another pair of Climbing Boots G! Woo! That is number three of the cheapest pair of boots. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> God, stop! This is ridiculous! This is actually ridiculous! That's a th <laughs> now it's Abort, change bank. Alright, change bank, change bank. Alright, let's find a let's find a better bank. Fishing guild bank? Alright, we'll try fishing. We gotta we gotta rebank the caskets here so that they're like, oh, oh look, a new place. Oh my god, it actually did it! <laughs> Someone in my stream, all right, for context on YouTube, someone in my stream is like, yo, bro, the reason you're unlucky is because you're going to the wrong banks. You have to, you have to go to, to the fishing, the fishing guild. First clue I opened, the fishing guild, gives me the freaking rangers. That's fucking great. All right. First pair of ranger boots. Technically, we deserve two or three more with the amount of clues that we've had. So hopefully we can keep that going. I am actually shocked. That's hilarious, dude. If you guys are enjoying the video so far, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you're new. I know about 82% of you guys aren't subscribed, and I promise you're going to want to subscribe and you're going to want to watch until the end of this video because there's a pretty nice surprise. Honestly, at this point, my goal is now that that is a sick looking clue. That is it. There's four uniques in one medium. That's nuts. Another slug looking wolf cloak. Okay. Okay. All right. Holy sandals. Okay. You know what? Pretty good. We haven't had those yet. You know what? Maybe a, it's a flat on 800 as well. What a, what a perfect time to get them. Flat on 800. I actually think we might get like really close. If not, we might actually complete like the entire log. That's that's crazy. We've now had all of the boots. I mean, you know, still want some more rangers, but we've now had all the boots. Yes. Yes. Rangers number two, baby! <laughs> Alright, you know what? I won't shit on the Dorgish Khan Bank. I won't shit on the Dorgish Khan Bank. Gets in you, right? Dorgish Khan Bank, that's where the money's at, bro. Alright, we are 100% without a doubt profiting now. That is freaking fantastic. Let's fucking go, dude. Rangers number two. Even if I don't get any more, I would like the third one because that's bare minimum what I should get, but I'll be, I'll be satisfied with the two. Hey, spiked manacles. I think that's uh, number three, right? Yeah, third spiked manacles. Pretty good. I'll take that. The the boots have kind of evened out aside from the the holy sandals. It's it's pretty nice. Eighty billionth gnomish fire lighter. Well, wait a minute. What? <laughs> Hold up. I just got two of the same page. All right. Oi! Let's go! I was about to say we're coming up on a thousand mediums, but there we go. Range is number three, baby! Woo! That's right there. Those three rangers alone have paid for all the implings. Those three rangers have paid for... Woodcutting Guild is a good one. Whoever said Woodcutting Guild, good job. That's a good pick. Hell yeah, dude. 
that is Rangers number three on clue 997. Hell yeah. Medium clue number 1,000. Gorgeous. Bro, we're closing in to the point where we really don't have a lot of uniques left to get. It's like all... Hey, holy sandals! Coming in with a Zami page, too. That's a nice looking clue right there. 1,061. We're on a bit of a dry streak for Masters, and I am perfectly fine with it, because I'm going to be honest, I'm really sick of doing Masters. That's holy sandals number two. Hey, holy sandals number three, I believe. I think we actually, like, have... I've come around to like a very even, <laughs> we have very even on the boots now, except for the climb boots. Gee, but even four of those, it's really not like that far out of line with the rest of them. Pretty nice, man. That's another, that's another one mil. One more ranger. Uh, that'd be nice. That's a nice looking clue. There's another rangers, baby. There you go. Speak of the devil. One more rangers. There it is. Easy money. Easy money, bro. <laughs> Easy money. Hell yeah, dude. That is Rangers number four. Big fucking profit, bro. Mmm. Mmm. Hey, Shackles. No, I keep calling them Shackles, they're not called Shackles. Manacles. That is Manacles number four. Hell yeah, dude. Alright. Three medium caskets left. You know I'm gonna get a master. Uh, yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just, just know it was gonna happen. Okay. All right. Here it is. Here it is. The last medium casket. Let's see. I, that's actually like a really nice looking casket, but it doesn't have any of the stuff that I need. Finishing on 1,335 medium clue scrolls. Which is pretty fantastic. I I am that's a lot of clues, bro. I must have jumped up like an insane amount of ranks <laughs> doing eleven seventy five mediums. Now I'm gonna do like a, a quick little scroll through this tab in case I don't make a selling montage. But I'm thinking I'm probably gonna make a selling montage. Some of the stuff at the top here, by the way, this is like you know stuff I was using for the actual clues. Then of course at the very top the boots that looks amazing. I love it. But we still have these master clues to open, so let's crack those open first. All right, let's start cracking these open 30, 30 caskets, which is apparently actually pretty unlucky. I, I should have had like, I don't know, several more than this, but I'm fine with it because I'm going to be honest, after an entire day, more than an entire day, this even just opening the caskets was spread over several days. I, I live streamed this whole thing and my current stream is like almost nine hours long. I've been doing masters all day and I really didn't want to do any more. So let's hope we get some cool stuff from this. And we've pretty much guaranteed profit already just from the four ranger boots. So we know everything is just purely money at this point. Pure profit. Very first one. You know what? That's not even pure profit. That's pure garbage right there. <laughs> All right. Got a unique lesser demon mask. I, I Honestly, I'm not even going to check the log for my masters because it's not really what this video is about. I'm not particularly... Uh, particularly interested in that so far these are some pretty underwhelming masters and never mind i got a mimic never mind not underwhelming at all That's pretty bad. I guess it... I just hit the mega rare table. I didn't even notice. <laughs> of course. I just clicked straight through it. I just thought it was like grimy Renars, bro. Because these already drop herbs. I was shit-talking masters. I clicked straight through it. That's a mega rare drop. 
On 91, I'm assuming, because that's 660k. Well, rip. That sucks. <laughs>
So you're gonna notice I'm selling a lot of these items for a lot lower than ALK price, and some of them don't even sell for below ALK price. So, you know, helpful tip to you guys, if you're looking to make some money, you could probably take a look at certain clue items and get some pretty easy flips, or just buy stuff to profitably ALK it. But now it's time to show you guys the total loot, since I'm sure one quick scroll through of the bank won't do it. So I'm gonna scroll through the rune light screenshots of all of the stuff and you can take a look. The items are sorted of course by the most expensive ones at the top and decreasing in price as you go down. Like I said, a lot of these items sell for far below what their grand exchange value says they are, and some of them even sell for substantially below ALK price. Now, I'm sure if I had waited longer, people would have picked them up because of fashion scape and other various reasons, but this video took me so long that I was on a really big time crunch, so I had to just dump all the items as fast as I possibly could. Of course, it's also really important to not neglect your master clues, because even if I hadn't gotten any really good uniques from this, the average master clue is somewhere in the margin of 300 to 400k without uniques. So, that's a really good amount of money, that means I would have made about 12 mil with no uniques. Alright, so we got rid of pretty much all of the cheaper items. Now we're gonna take out, you know, the more expensive ones. I mean, I guess the, the climbing boots aren't particularly expensive, but you gotta admit, that inventory looks pretty fresh, bro. <laughs> it looks pretty nice, man. Alright, so let's just sell all this stuff off here. Gonna, gonna work this a, a little on the slower side, because I don't want it to lose a whole lot of money. I think most of it's probably gonna instant sell for pretty much, like, exactly what it says it's worth, just because these are items that are pretty commonly used by pures and just random players throughout the community. Whoops, I only sold one there, I meant to sell all of them. Well, I know they sell for this price, so dump them all in there. These ones might not sell. These are... These are garbage. I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> oh, that's surprising they actually did sell. And the wizard boots. All in. But at minus five, these are a little, little on the cheaper end. Well, there we go. 105 mil. And we still actually have four pairs of ranger boots. Pretty nice. Now, I'm gonna sell... I'm gonna sell these ranger boots a little slower than the other stuff, and we'll see what they end up selling for. Damn. Damn. <laughs> that looks... That looks really nice, man. That looks really nice, I gotta say. 251 mil when we started with 100. Woo! I am happy that is over. Honestly, I had a pretty good time doing it, but it did take me somewhere in the margin of 125 to 150 hours to do, which is kind of outside of the scope of what the average player is probably going to want to do in terms of clue scrolls. But we did profit. I mean, it you know took us over 100 hours to do all that. And we made 150 mil, about 150 hours, you know, a little over a mil an hour. Pretty good, actually. You know, it's, it's profit. I didn't actually expect to make this much money at all, actually. I thought maybe I'll make 50, 60 mil doing this. So that's pretty incredible. You're probably also noticing that in the last clip I sold all of my ranger boots, but now I have one in my inventory again. And some of you guys are smart enough to guess why right off the bat, but to those of you who might not have picked up on it, in my hard clue video I gave away a bond because I made a little bit of profit, and I make these videos on my main just to have fun. I don't really care too much about actually making profit, it's just kind of doing fun tests to, you know, experiment and see what can happen. So since I made so much money doing this, I don't need this fourth pair of ranger boots. So I'm going to be giving it away, in the comment section down below. I'd rather these ranger boots go to somebody who can probably get better use out of them since I don't really need the money on my main anyway like I said. Now if you want a chance of winning them all you have to do is leave a like on the video, leave a comment down below, and make sure you are subscribed to the channel preferably turning on notifications as well so you don't miss any future videos. In a couple of days I will be checking back and pinning a random comment and replacing probably the current pinned comment with the winner so if I pick your comment and you don't have your RuneScape name I can't give you the boots, so make sure you do that. Liking the video and subscribing is just as essential as commenting, so make sure you guys are doing that if you want a chance at winning Ranger Boots. And also, I'd really appreciate the subscriptions just because, like I said, this video took me a really long time to make, and I had a very short time to make it, so I really pushed myself to get this one done. If you want to see any more of my content, you can follow me over on my Twitter page, link down below. You can watch me live on twitch.tv, also down below. And you can join my Discord if you want a community of people to hang out with, as well as my clan chat for the same reason. So my clan chat is Dave. My Discord and all those other links are down below. Like, comment, subscribe if you want a chance of winning these Ranger Boots. Have a fantastic day. 
and I will see you guys in the next week's video.